to Kia. Got the knowledge, y'all. Hi guys, it's Guru Shakita, and today we are exploring Stalker Stories. So I never discussed this with anybody <laughs> before. Wait, maybe. No, it was a hard time, y'all. I was in like junior year in <laughs> high school. And, like, I never dated no guy or nothing, so it was like, I was, it was this awkward kid that he was new to school, and I wanted to be nice to him and shit. Like, I was the only one, like, being nice to him. Like, I was like, why is everybody being so rude? <laughs> <laughs> and I never knew, like, guys can, like, fall in love with you or some shit for being nice to them, especially when they're awkward or something, or don't have a lot of friends. But I guess since I was the only person and only girl being nice to him, he got, like, really attached to me. And then, like, so it was a hard time because I didn't know who to go to when he started being clingy. Like, and then when I did go to my coach in school, he was just like, well, you shouldn't have given him your number. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> That's not <laughs> helping at all. What the? He was just like, well, he would, he would, like, everybody would shun this kid because he was just weird. He would do, like, I don't know if he would talk a lot or he would just do weird things. And he, I, it would, you know, you guys know how I was in high school where it was, like, different sections for people in pet rallies. Well, I was in the senior section or some shit, and he was supposed to be in the freshman section. And he went over there in the senior section with me to sit with me, and they were looking at me like, okay, you know, get to your section. And then everybody looked at me crazy like, you know, you're going to have to tie him up. Like, why is he sitting there with me? <laughs> and I'm like, I don't know how to make him leave. Like, <laughs> That's cute. And then, <laughs> so he would just follow me everywhere, and then, like, it got really bad. It, it creeped me out because, I, you know, keep in mind, I'm innocent. I'm like, don't know nothing about dating and stuff. <laughs> so we ended up in a stairwell one day when everyone's in class. Because, like, you know, I used to skip and shit and bullshit yeah. around. But I'm sitting here chilling with him because I'm like, well, he's just weird. He's, I'm just letting him be weird, you know. But then he started, this is the crazy part. Like, he showed me his penis. <laughs> field trip and I'm just gonna call him D. <laughs> <laughs> he whipped his I was just like niggas is whipped his and then I, I got in trouble. I got in trouble because he said I started it. <laughs> How? I'm in fifth grade. I think this somebody needs to tell me something about sex. Exactly like we're innocent at that time so it was just weird. It was just a weird time y'all. It was just weird. <laughs> Men I don't know, They're but... They're forward. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I had met this guy. And... And so call him Larry. Larry. <laughs> so basically, me and Larry were talking over the phone and mm -hmm. stuff like that. And he liked music and stuff, so... And I like music, so I thought it was going to be all cool and gravy, but no. It always, uh, it always starts like that, dude. <laughs> so basically... We were, we were we were fine. We were fine. And then he started getting all, like, sad and upset and stuff. And I have nothing wrong with depression and stuff, but it was just to the point where he was calling me and asking me if I would kill him. I would kill him. So, basically, he was blah, 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 all that. And he was like, if I gave you a knife, would you stab me? If I gave you a gun, would you shoot me? I was just like, whoa. Well, there. So, I told my brother and I told my sisters and my family and stuff. So, they were just like, block him. I thought it was all cool and gravy, and I blocked him. But somehow he found my Instagram. He found her mm -hmm. Instagram. Oh, just the same guy. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> he found like.
like basically all of our Instagrams, and I told them I was like, "Yo, you need to block this dude. He's yeah. crazy." I remember that. Like, like I remember when he yeah. followed my stuff and my other, like my sister. I was like, like "No!" We were just like, "What the fuck? What's going on?" Oh, but basically, he found all of our stuff. He kept messaging me, and it was just, it was just crazy. Yeah, that was crazy. <laughs> So everybody funny. blocked him. That was the end of happy story. I'm not. We dead. think that was in our was it? <laughs> Stalker story. The soccer dude was fucking. You talking about? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't like my teeth. <laughs> <laughs>